Ladies and gentlemen, the following is a six-figure fight. Five rounds of action for the PFL Europe Lightweight Championship. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. He is a kickboxing specialist and stands five feet 11 inches tall. He weighed in officially at 154 and one half pounds. And he holds a perfect professional record of 10 victories and no defeats. Fighting out of Austin, Poland, the auditor, Jakob Kershuba. And his opponent fighting out of the red corner. He is an MMA specialist and stands six feet tall. He weighed in officially at 154 and one half pounds and in nine fights has earned a record of eight wins and a single loss. Fighting out of Dubai by way of Cork Island. John the Ripper Mitchell. Referee in charge, Rich Mitchell. Mitchell in the green, Kashuba in the gray, Stefan Struve is back, Sean O'Connor and Dan Hardy also here on the broadcast desk. Touch of the gloves and we're underway. The Irish crowd loving John Mitchell. Man, I just do not know how this fight's gonna play out. They're both so well-rounded and so skilled. The conditioning is evidence on both of them. John Mitchell doing a good job of managing the range. We're gonna see a lot more striking out of Mitchell this time. The takedowns was what he was working with in his last two fights, but Kasuba is incredibly strong. The jab is gonna be really important for Mitchell in this fight. Nice leg kick there from John Mitchell. And we saw in Kashuba's last fight against two, he, he really turned the tide with his gas tank. A couple of left hands from that sort of low crouching guard for Kashuba, changing the angle. Kashuba's almost standing like he's expecting Mitchell to level change. Looks like he's waiting to defend the takedown. Mitchell's been working really hard on his boxing, finishing off this training camp, sparring with Brendan Lochte and Conor McGregor. You've got to think that's going to really add to his confidence in this striking range. It's a completely different striker, though. Tries to get over the top with those powerful overhands. Sharp kick already redness showing on the outside of Jakub Kashuba's lead leg. Kashuba kind of content to circle around the outside of the smart cage. Just kind of picking at the face of uh, Kasuba. Lovely level change there from Kasuba, but what a takedown defender. Gives the Matador symbol. A little styling from John Mitchell. Goes after that lead leg again, putting a lot on those kicks as well. There's that left jab. The angle it's coming from, from Kashuba, is causing Mitchell problems in defending it. Yeah, it's really unusual because he's traveling forward with his feet. He's actually changing his stance as he steps through. John Mitchell's doing a good job of giving him the space to express that technique without taking... Oh! Kasuba tries to wrestle out of this. Kasuba might have just been able to recover there for a second. Wow, front kick to the face, dropped him. Great job by the, by the referee of letting this go. Mitchell now doing the right thing, trying to earn a separation here. He knows he's got Kasuba hurt. Good head position here from Mitchell. Surely he's going to break and want to strike here. Kasuba needs to hang on. He needs to clear his head. He looks foggy still. Sharp knee to the midsection from Mitchell, who now is engaging in this 
this cage wrestling. He should try to frame and creates distance. Let's go back to striking like he's doing right now. There's the front kick again, but this time to the body. Kostuba still looks shaky to me. That lead leg still got damage on it as well. Unstable on his base. Goes Mitchell. back to the lead leg. Yeah, attacked it again. Mitchell's looking phenomenal on his feet tonight. Goes to the high kick. Blocked by Kashuba. Now Kashuba blitzes forward, but Mitchell's having none of it. And the damage that he's done to the lead leg is making it difficult for Kasuba to travel forward with his punches. Struggles to put weight on that lead leg, as you can see. There's there it is again. again man. The front wow. kick this time from the rear leg, and now straight right hands. He's got Kashuba frozen. Back he goes. Oh, oh, cut. Cut. And he falls into this clinch. Mitchell's going to have to frame out, work his way back to the center. 40 seconds left. Serious first round for John Mitchell. May even be a 10-8 on some scorecards. Now Kashuba tests the high kick. Mitchell tries to go hammer at that lead leg again, gets himself spun around. Kasuba lost the first round in Paris against Dylan too, but came back really strong in the second and third round, so. Good point, Stefan, very good point. Final 10 seconds. We know he's got that toughness and stay in power to make this a long, hard fight. John Mitchell in the green, Jakob Kashuba blitzing forward in the gray. That lead leg is seriously compromised from Kasuba. The way that he's standing, he's opening that center channel for the front kick again. And that's obviously a weapon that Mitchell has liked from this training camp, maybe from the tape study he did on Jakob Kashuba. Now Kashuba grabbing this clinch, trying to dirty box. Mitchell shrugs it off. Well, the thing that's worth noting as well, if I'm coming, if I'm looking at this from Mitchell's perspective, as Kasuba's moving to his to his side, he's moving to his right, he's crossing his feet, which is not ideal, especially with damage on the lead leg. This is what we saw from Diego Braga in his first fight against Jesus Pinedo. Mitchell engaging in the clinch here. There's the uppercut again, but good block by, by Katsuba. Mitchell needs to get that jab back popping. Everything happens from that jab. That's a risky punch John Mitchell just threw. Started a combination with the rear uppercut. There it is there again. It is again. <laughs> The uppercut worked real well for him in the first round, but you got to lead it in with a jab. How does you give Katsuba the opportunity to counter like he's done now? Now John Mitchell pressing into the barrier here. Good half positioning here by John Mitchell. Nice work with that shoulder strike. And he gets clear again. Strikes by Katsuba there. Set the uppercut up with a jab this time. Goes back to the front kick. There it is again. Kashuba would be much more careful with his own lead leg now. The rear uppercut. Mitchell's loving it right now. There's the Jumps power from Katsuba. Good knee to the body from Kasuba there. This is exactly what he did in the fight in Paris against Dylan Took. Started wearing on Took. Those arms are getting heavier then. Yes, absolutely. And this would be a benefit for him into the later rounds. The oh, nice knee. Day. He's got Mitchell. Oh, he's Mitchell got Mitchell down. Kasuba pounding away. Mitchell trying to build back up here. Referee giving him a moment to recover, but Kasuba's coming up strong. He's flattening him out. And just pouring on the That's deck. That's it, there is a victory. Yaku Kashuba with the comeback. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Rich Mitchell calls a halt to the action.
at three minutes and seven seconds of round number two, declaring your winner via TKO and 2023 PFL Europe lightweight champion, Jakob Kashuba. All right, Jakob Kashuba's doing me a favor by not hugging me and getting his blood all over my beautiful suit. But you look so nice. I want to hug him, but I can't. Thank you, Jakob. Let's talk about this win. Adversity in the first round. He dropped you with the front kick. He had you hurt again with a couple punches after, and you wrestled your way out of that. Did you go back to the corner knowing what had happened in round one? I did not. He just reminded me. I got fucking hurt. Excuse me. But, uh... I'm a Polish man. I go forward. And I saw him gas and he was getting tired. He was putting everything in the, in the, in the, in the, everything into the punches in the first round. But I was patient. I was listening to my coach Gene and I don't stop. Well, you don't stop. And we've seen this a couple fights in a row now where it's the cardio and it's the pressure that breaks down your opponent. This time it wins you a European championship. What does this mean for you moving forward? Thank you, sir. Congratulations. Appreciate it. What does this mean? We go forward for glory and for Polska! So, Listen, Jakob, this belt comes with a check you're going to get in a second, but it also comes with a place in the PFL global season. How do you stack up in the chase for $1 million in 2024? I'm coming for it. I can, I can smell it. <laughs> Congratulations, my friend. Where's Pete Murray? He's got a big check to give you. Incredible performance, ladies and gentlemen. Headed to the PFL Global roster, your 2023 lightweight European champion, Jakub Kashuba. <laughs>